everybody, this is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited to be back in the Florida Panhandle, starting for my first time in Tallahassee, Florida. We'll be in the Panhandle, I think, for like a week, but again, first time in Tallahassee, Florida. We have lots of people here, which is much appreciated. <laughs> The location of Great Plates. Lewis, the owner and his team have cooked me up a whole bunch of great looking and smelling food. We've got one hour to finish everything here, but to start, we've got two of their XL plates. I went with a hibachi plate, which has steak, shrimp, and chicken over some fried rice with some healthy broccoli. And then I've got some yum yum sauce here. And then I went with their seafood XL plate. That's got some salmon, more shrimp, some of Lewis's homemade seafood macaroni and cheese. I've heard that's delicious. And then there is some more healthy broccoli. All of that is served over more rice. They are known for their burgers here, their chicken wings, and then their egg rolls. So we got some of those. We've got three different egg rolls right here. One was their Philly cheese steak, another was their chicken, and then the third was their seafood. We've got those, and then we got six wings. There's three Parmesan garlic, and then three hot buffalo. I decided to go with a quesadilla burger, so that is gonna be yummy. And then right here, this is scary, but thankfully it's not too thick. It's an order of their specialty fries, a large order, but for this, I went with their 40 drip chicken fries. Lewis's Nick name is 40? Yes, so we've got these 40 drip fries and there's like 40 delicious looking sauces on top, but we've got all this. In addition, I don't know if it's part of the challenge, but I'm gonna try to finish it anyway. This is a blueberry lemonade, and then this is part of the challenge, a dessert. Lewis made me up a strawberry cheesecake cup. So this is more than a cup, this is a lot, but I think I'm gonna get it. One hour to finish everything. If I fail, it's gonna be $100. But if I win, I'll get my meal free. I will get a sweet t-shirt down to my collection, and I'll be the first person with my name and photo here on the Wall of Fame. Let's get this challenge started. <laughs> All right, this is my first time in Tallahassee, Florida, which is exciting, the home of the Florida State Seminoles. Big thank you to Lewis and his team and everybody here with Great Plates in Tallahassee, Florida. Let's shut up and eat, starting with these three egg rolls. I wanna eat these while they're still warm, and I'm gonna dip them into their yum yum sauce, which is right here, but ain't nothing to it but to do it. Let's eat. One, two, three, boom. All right. Starting with the Philly cheesesteak. All of these egg rolls are made fresh every day. That first one reminded me this is not a low sodium challenge. This is seafood and if that is any kind of thing like what this macaroni and cheese is gonna taste like, I'm excited. I think this is their chicken, I'm pretty confident in that. Buffalo chicken, that is yummy. Let's finish off the chicken. All right, last bite of the egg rolls. I'm gonna do the fries, but I'm gonna do the wings first. I wanna eat these before they get cooled down, but these are Parmesan garlic. Fried with love. There's so much different food here, which is why I'm wearing the boom shirt, because there's so much on the logo, but ooh, all right. Five minutes, 55 seconds in. Now it's time for the three hot buffalo wings. Last one. We'll try out this blueberry lemonade. That is not sugar free and it is good. All right, next we're gonna do the quesadilla burger. This has so much on it, I don't think we're gonna need that sauce. Seven minutes, 40 seconds in. That was good. 
It's gonna turn into a rice eating challenge, I think, here in a little bit. I'm trying to think of what I wanna do next. All right, Katina says fries. If we lose, it's Katina's fault. All right, and as you can see, the fries look daunting because of the area, but it's not very thick. It's only six or seven pounds. I'm just kidding. I would say there's over a pound though, but let's get them down. A lot of potatoes here. They're pretty clean on the bottom, so I can eat these with my hands. Making great progress, almost there. 16 minutes, 15 seconds in. This is a new shirt too, I gotta already wash it. I'm glad I ate these early because I would not have wanted to eat them later on. push them down with some delicious, healthy broccoli. So we'll eat the broccoli off both plates and then go for the meats. Both XL3 plates. Lots of eyes watching tonight, I gotta do this. Let us actually do the salmon first. We got some yum yum sauce. Lewis, the owner, started everything out of his own house's kitchen back in 2016, and then he opened up this brick and mortar store, Great Plates, in 2018, and now he's doing well. So, congratulations to him. <laughs> Happy to be here to help kick off this challenge, but let's finish the salmon, we'll do the shrimp, mac and cheese, rice, and then we'll work on this hibachi plate. As you know from previous Florida videos, I hate peel and eat shrimp, luckily, these only have the tails. We're all good. Very well seasoned, too. Mac and cheese. This has, I think, shrimp and crab in it. Oh, yeah. This is going rougher than I expected, but we're going to get it. This is really high, but there's a whole bunch of plastic underneath, so it's not as bad as I was thinking. Oh, that's good. Great Plates has great service. Oh, shit. And I am not a great pork. Let's finish up some of the shrimp first. All right, I'm gonna power through this. When we put all this food down, I did not think it was that great of a meal. It's inside. So we got 20 minutes to go. We're doing okay. More of a mind game right now. Finish off the chicken, then it's rice time. If I lose, I'm the idiot because I did choose some of the harder XL plates. There's like hardly any left, but then we got this dessert. That was optional, we're almost done with that. I'm trying to leave myself 10 minutes for the dessert. Here we go, oh. come on, let's go. This 
blueberry lemonade is coming in really handy. We're 49 minutes in. 11 to go. Whether it was optional or not, it's gone. Persistence is what has gotten Lewis to this point with great plates and persistence bite after bite is what got me here. So uh, it wasn't really until this point that I thought I was gonna win. I thought I had a shot, but this is sitting well in my stomach. We're gonna get this, my first win coming up in Tallahassee. I am so thankful to have gotten this victory. There was a while where I didn't think it was gonna happen, but oh. Domination! Ah. Oh. Thank you everybody that was cheering me on through Facebook Live. Everybody that was cheering against me, thanks to you as well. 56 minutes and 6 seconds. Yes. That was such a delicious, greatest plate food challenge here at Great Plates in Tallahassee, Florida. Thank you guys all for being here. I'm really not sure what my favorite part was. The seafood mac and cheese was great. The Both of the XL plates would have been a lot more delicious if I had eaten them early on. I did enjoy, I was surprised by the quesadilla burger. Both of the wings were great and then I had them really early on, so all three of those egg rolls were great. I really don't have a favorite, but if I had to, I love buffalo chicken, so we'll go with the chicken one. But the seafood and the Philly cheesesteak were great too. So big thank you to Lewis and his team, everybody here with great plates. I am going to get the $100 meal for free, the well-earned $100 meal for free. I'm also going to get a sweet t-shirt that probably doesn't fit right now to add to my collection, and I'll get my name and photo on the first up on their wall of fame. So yes. I've got another food challenge, a pizza challenge coming up in Tallahassee tomorrow, but it was overall win number 961. Thank you guys for watching.